A letter arrived for you. I left it in your room.
Paris. Er, uh, on... Paris. September 23rd, 1788. Dear Arno, I never thought I could be so bored in Paris. Can you imagine it? The greatest city in the world, and here I am, stuck in endless lectures from dawn to dusk. It's worse than that winter we spent in Strasbourg. Do you remember? When it snowed for a week straight, and we couldn't leave the house, and all the books in the library were in German. <laughs> we convinced that cook the house was haunted by some young Frankish prince. And the poor man refused to leave his kitchen without a rosary in one hand, and a Bible in the other. I miss those days. The things I'm learning from father's friends are... Well, I wish I could tell you about them. Someday, perhaps. But not now. And not like this. But still, I find myself missing those days. Missing home. Missing you. Next time father comes to Paris, you must persuade him to bring you along. I remain always your, Elise. Oh, Arno. What have you done? I know we didn't part on the best of terms, but to go running to the assassins? My father kept you away from them for a reason. Their creed is like wine, sweet enough at first blush, and in moderation it makes life seem more bearable. But drink too deeply, and you find naught but madness and anarchy. No doubt they've already filled your mind with tales of how dreadful we Templars are, that we would make slaves of humanity, and place our boots on the world's neck. You knew my father, and you know me. I can only pray that is enough to give the lie to those tales. My order has turned against me, and I am hunted by those I once called friend. I could not bear it if you turned against me also. Think of me, and be well, Elise. I hope I know what I'm doing. Hey, Arno. You look terrible. For months, I have been wrangling the Brotherhood, the National Assembly, and the King. Taken all together, they have the political acumen of an especially stupid village council. I believe that excuses my appearance, young man. I meant no disrespect, Mentor. I am only concerned. Forget me, Arlo. Weep for France. But enough politics. I hope you have happier news. What of Lord de Lassaire's murderers? The King of Beggars is dead. He was carrying this. Repose on pay. You should keep it. It'll do no one any good moldering in a forgotten crypt. Carry it with honor. Thank you. I will. The mission. The King of Beggars and Sivert were only pawns in a larger game. Someone sent them after Monsieur de la Serre. Templars do nothing simply, do they? 
Do you have anything solid on this mysterious chess player? The only lead I have is the instrument that killed De La Serre, a pin fashioned by a silversmith named Germain. But how he's involved, I can't yet say. It seems your course is clear. Find the silversmith, learn what part he plays. How are you, Anna?
Well, that's not suspicious, is it? Hey! Oh, still you runt! I've got a message for you! Shift your ass here, now! This is my passion! <laughs>
Ah! 
Monsieur Germain, the silversmith. Thank God. They've been holding me for months. Please, get me out of here. First, I need to know about this. No time. I'll tell you all I know once we're away. But we must leave before the guards return. Fine, let's go. No. They'll be watching the front entrance. We'll have to go downstairs and across. Follow me then, and stay quiet. Far now, can he? This way. Of course. Wait, keep moving. Of course. Hold a moment.
Best we move on. We keep one eye to the roofs. Just how important are you as a prisoner? You think you can lose me? Ha! Shit! Hey, Something's going on. Hey! Show yourself! to do anything foolish, let the silversmith go. Stay back. I'll be good. What have I done? Only what you had to. Come, we must go. Yes, of course. So you will make it Soyez le bienvenu. Stop you! Yes, you! Come back here! I'll turn you into horses! Thank you, my friend. You've done me a great service today. Perhaps you can return the favor. Yes, of course. May I? I made the first some years ago on a private contract. A man called Lafreniere. That seemed an unusual commission. I confess, curiosity got the better of me. Recently, I started to look into Lafreniere's background, and what I discovered, you wouldn't believe it. He's a Templar. Is that what you found? Yes. I believe so. I didn't know how to take it. In any case, I was careless, and Lafreniere found out about my schemes. I've been under house arrest ever since. I do as he bids. Weapons, mostly. Where can I find him? Well, Lafreniere is a very difficult man to pin down. Not long ago, I overheard him talking about protecting the shipments at La Alloblé. It sounded ominous, whatever he meant. And I ask, why are you so interested in him? killed someone very dear to me. I want to know why. I see. You have my sympathies. They will come looking for you again. Make yourself scarce. Yes, I believe I might. <laughs> 